Hey guys, Chucky Boy here once again with my PES 2014 Master League series, and I promised you a special episode, and here it is. There are a few reasons as to why it's a little bit special. As you can see on the screen, um, eagle-eyed viewers will notice we have a brand new kit. I said we'd have new kits for the new season, and we have three, so I'm going to run through these right now. As you can see, we're stuck with the Hummel um, sponsor because we quite like the way they look. We've, got, we've gone for vertical strike this time, down the middle, and obviously same colour schemes as before for the home kit. It looks pretty cool, to be honest, I like it. Now, for the away kit, we've slightly tweaked things a little bit. Um, we had navy blue and red before, we've now gone with black and red. As you can see, it looks pretty cool. Um, we've added a third colour to that, which is white. Um, we have white on our badge as well, so, you know, we all have to incorporate it somewhere other than the third kit. So, I think those three colours go quite well together. So, that's our second kit. And our third kit is, as last season was, a white and blue. It's the same design as the away kit, um, just obviously different colours. I think they look pretty good. And they're going to be our kits for their brand new season, which is great. And uh, we're going to play in our purple and yellow this time. Um, okay, so there's the kits. The second reason this is a special game if you like is due to the fact that we are playing against AC Milan as you can see um, for you, those of you don't, that don't know Argentina has a huge Italian uh, community if you like um, teams like Vela Sarsfield and things like that were actually founded by Italians you know years and years and years ago and actually still incorporate the colors of the Italian flag and stuff like that in their badge you can see um, the colors there so um, I wanted to, wanted to be against an Italian team, really, so I, I went with AC Milan because I haven't really played against them very often, to be honest, and I kind of wanted to play against them in this little special game. And the third reason is uh, a special reason, which I'm not going to show you because you'll see it anyway in a few seconds or so. Hopefully, if I've done this right. Don't let me down now. And there we go. As you can see, we have a brand new home stadium. For the brand new season. Now, um, the reason behind this is obviously I don't like sharing stadiums with real teams. Um, you have to slightly um, forgive the fact that I had Santos on the pitch, you know, for the entire first season. Now we have ourselves a brand new stadium that nobody else will will be using in game. So it's purely just for us. And as you can see, we have Pez World on the kit again, on the front and the back this time. It looks pretty cool in my eyes. I like the, the, the new layout of the kit. And yeah, the stadium looks really cool, as you can see. A nice open stadium. Uh, a very Latin American feel to it, if you like. So this is going to be our new home ground, as, as from the new season. And this is the very first game being played at it. You know, it's a opening of the stadium, if you like. And yeah, let's get into this, guys. And hopefully we can do our, our new stadium and our new kit and everything proud. As you can see, guys, we have our, our new signings in the team. Um, all of them are having a go today. Now, the difference I mentioned about, uh, is it Sir Clark or whatever his name was? He is now Okamoto, who is a real-life Alba Rex Niigata player. So, um, he is now in our team. He's still Australian, according to my Master League, but in the real game, he will be Japanese, obviously. So, But we have our two new centre-backs. We have uh, Petzela and Karutso there, too, which is great news for us. Um, our big signings, if you like, were, were our defenders, so it's nice that they finally uh, are in the team and ready. We have Leone at left back. We don't really want to get rid of that guy because he's kind of an icon, if you like, for me. Um, I really do like him. Um, so, yeah, we've got those guys still in the team. We've managed to fit them all in, really. Uh, obviously, Wildcow is still the main man up front. Which is always going to be the case after last season. Oh, Balotelli's through here. Can we do something? Ah, oh dear. I didn't want to do that, but I had to bring him down. You're probably going to go off as too. Ah, oh dear. Not a great start to our new stadium, but I had to do it, guys. I'm sorry. I had to do it. Obviously, not. there's nothing too, too major riding on this game right now, but... You know, I, I don't want to get annihilated, so let's see what we can do here. Oh, what a save. 
There we go. That's the brand new keeper instantly in the good books. Lopez is uh, obviously he's going to be our number one keeper now. We obviously missed out. We made a, a mistake, I guess, in the uh, in the Rossi uh, keeper situation. But you know, we got one that was not too. The only difference is the age, really. Um, the only difference was, I think, one hundred and fifty thousand dollar pounds or whatever it is. So it's not really a big a big difference. So. I'm not too disappointed, but they, it's made a save, so I'm happy. I'll take that one, definitely. So there we have half-time, guys. Not a lot of highlights to show. But, uh, yeah, we've, we're holding our own, effectively. I mean, they've had a lot more possession than we have, so... It's always going to be tough, but... Um, it's not really about the performance today. It's just about celebrating the fact that we have a brand new home ground and whatnot so the performance is not such a big deal to be honest of course we've had our new goalkeeper cover himself in glory already by saving the Balotelli penalty doesn't miss very often I think he's only missed one in real life so um, I'll take the penalty save against him any day really so there we have it guys nil nil at full time not a terribly exciting game but like I said earlier it's not about the performance Although we held our own against a really good team. Um, it's, this is purely a, uh, a friendly game to open our brand new stadium. And I think it went pretty well. So I hope you guys are excited about the new season to come. We're not going to go to penalties. We're going to leave it as it is. Um, and yeah, hopefully the brand new stadium may help us get where we need to be. And you never know. It could be a great season for us. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you all again very, very soon.